Hey everybody, welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. So we're going to do a short apprentice level mission just to get some people running around, get them leveling up. We've got a new healer, which we can put on the right track. Um, I've got nearly all the stuff that I want with the healer. Was there anyone else in the stagecoach? Another highwayman could be good actually. We need another highwayman, so let's, uh, so you're, you're not particularly great. Curious, obsessed with the acquisition of knowledge, not my favourite, but you've got pistol shot, point blank shot, no... Who's got the grape shot? Come on now, you've got a grape shot. Fearless advanced pistol shot, you're actually better. Even though you've got thin blood and fear of beasts, you're alright. We'll take you. And um, we're going to try some low light fun to see if that'll work. So who are we taking out? Um, first things first though. While I've... Oh yeah, did I actually? Oh no, that's right. Aye, I need to upgrade my weapon smithing, so we need some deeds. We need some deeds. Where do we get deeds? We get deeds down here, so we'll do this one. And then we can do the, you know, the, the veteran level afterwards. So I'm going to take myself. Why not? Hmm. In fact, before we do so, you have the party heal, but you don't actually have the good heal, so I'm going to have to teach you. I'm going to have to teach you the good heal. Can't really do anything here. Divine Grace, the important one. Base bash, you come off, put Divine Grace on. Perfect, solid play. We'll go in and we'll try and get some deeds here. And we're going to play on very low light. As in, I'm taking no torches at all. It'll work, it'll be good. Right, who else am I taking? Watson. Watson, you can come with. You'll be fine. Then in the third position, you can take the healer. And the fourth position, take the jester. Aye. Aye. I like the sound of that. I oddly very much like the sound of that. So did, does someone have something good here? Aye, you've got the sun cloak. You don't need the sun cloak or the dodge stone at the moment. While people are healing. Book of stuff. Book of stuff. You can keep that because it's grave robber only. Um, you can keep that because it's particular to yourself. Right, so Watson, do you need... You've got you've got the, the helmet already. Is there a second helmet that we can put on? Oh, I've got three. Oh, I've got so many of these fucking helmets. Stun and bleed skills, less damage, that doesn't seem very good. Move amulet, no. More protection, more dodge. Ah, the, the sun cloak is not good though, because we don't need that, because we're going low light. There's really the moon ring we're looking for. So light below 25, more damage, less accuracy. The light is high, okay, fucking hell. I'll give it to Watson, why not, we'll try it, we'll see if that makes any difference. I'm not going to worry too much about the trinkets, this should be, you know, a simple in and out exercise. So the key here is 8 food. Given where we're going, I'll take 2 shovels just in case, 2 anti-venom, and you know, holy water, and I herbs. No, I don't need the herbs actually, that's that's a mistake, I wouldn't need to bring those. Um, I want to bring 2 bandage. Never use them all. I might use them all. Oh, fuck it. Who cares? Well, it'll, it'll be fun. It'll be a laugh. So, the reason that we're doing low light is I found when I was streaming that low light gets you just more stuff. Obviously, as, you know, it's told, you're told in the game, the lower the light, the more the loot. I don't think you realise until you do low light that it's not that hard. <laughs> the stress isn't that bad. And, quite frankly, the rewards are fantastic. So that's what we'll do. Stack me. Give me the sack. The sack is... <laughs> the pack? The sack? It's already been looted. Um, Vestal. Troubling effigy. I know this doesn't work, does it? It does work. Okay. Night Owl. What does that mean? Light below 25 extra speed. That works perfectly for what we're doing. It's as if the game knows that because I don't have shovel shovels? That because we don't have torches. It just knows. The game knows. The game is smart. Right. Spiders. None of your fish. Let me go first. Jester goes first. Do we do the party ballad? Inspiring tune. Ah, uh, we go for party ballad. Buff. Buffing with the Jester. Okay, buffed. Dazzling light. You've got a good stun resist, don't you? You actually don't. I forgot about that. But I'm going to focus down the back party members. Because the spitters are, quite frankly, rather harrowing to deal with. Marked, resisted the whatever it was going to do. Probably a debuff. Wow! It's not even that. It's not even that fucking light. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me? What's that all about? Okay, so the game has decided that yes, it is shitting me. Um, just kill this thing. He dodged it. Of course he dodged it. Why not? Why, why would you not dodge it? So the Jester, of course, is on death's door already. 
that no one could have ever possibly have imagined that that would have been the case. No one would have known. He's going to die. Um, fuck you all. Done. Nice. Right, first things first, heal the Jester before they die, and then give the Jester a turn so I can, you know, give it some love with the anti-venom. Jester, we know you need some you need some help here. Probably a breakthrough, to be honest. If I go dirty breakthrough, wasn't the greatest breakthrough. We get the debuff, that's fine. I'll deal with it. We'll deal with it in due course. This fight has been a little bit threatening so far. I wasn't prepared. The game's probably been updated. And it's probably harder again, you know. They, they do this whenever I get used to doing something. I'm so behind the eight ball. That um, whenever they do something, or whenever a meta comes up, and I'm like, I'm going to, I'm going to adopt that and do what this, what everyone else is doing, because it looks cool. By the time I do it, it's probably nerfed and changed, so you can't do it anymore. Wow, the jester is really getting a hard time here. So he's just going to buff. I could be using his dark stab, but I think the buff is fine. If it bleeds on the middle guy, fuck you. Give them no quarter. I don't want to stack buffs, to be honest. Big old crit, big old dirty crit, good, solid play. We get another shot with the Vestal, I will heal. What are you talking about, narrator? That was ages ago, we finished. That happened months ago, months ago. The thing you're commenting, I should really have dark stabbed and went for the kill. Do I should have. Um, would have loved to have healed with the Vestal, but you know, you do what you can. Heirloom chest, we'll get some free stuff. Three goodies. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Oh aye, finding the stuff. Aye, ah, getting the stuff home is the problem, is what he's trying to say. Because we don't have a lot of stuff. We don't have a lot of space. Left luggage. I'm glad. We got free holy water. That'll be useful. Never probably. Maybe it will be, who knows. We're getting the heirlooms though, and that's the important thing. Crests and deeds. Deeds are the important one. We need 11 deeds, I think it was. To get where we need to be. Um, no, I'm not even going to take the torch. No point. What I will do, however, is be sneaky and put a bandage on this guy. Get some deeds and some money. Right, now we're down to 40. 28 light. Oh, ho, ho. Naughty, naughty. So everything's going to get hard. In the game. And everywhere else. It's going to be tough. We do have the shovels requisite to get through here. So once we get to bl um, black is pitch, things get kind of tough. Um, I shouldn't do this, but I am going to. That's fine. We, we you know, resisted the urges. We resisted the, the trap. Are we on 90% of room battles? Or is it, no, 90% of rooms. What are we? We're skirmishing. All right, scout. We've got a scout. So we just go back up this way then. We can avoid that room at the bottom. And... Also, you'll notice the music changing. Someone had mentioned that in a comment before. They said, the music kind of gets repetitive, but it's because I was playing at very high light the whole time. You'll notice that on lower light, music's a bit more harrowing. One trap on the Jester and he's fucked. Yeah, I see it. I see it. I see it. 40% on trap. 40% on trap. 0% on trap. And 40%. So it's, I'll go Bounty Hunter. That seems to make sense in my head. Terrible idea. Mechanic Horrible idea. Hazards. Watson, what are you doing? What are you doing with your life? I'm going to use that just because. Now, we haven't starved just yet, but I imagine it's going to happen soon. And when it does, I will be ready. Seriously? No more battles. No more room battles. We've got no more room battles. This is good. We've got two. Hmm. We'll see. We'll play it by ear. Okay, we've got a fight. We could die! We could lose the Jester here! Please give me first turn. Damn. That kinda sucks. Jester's on death's door again. One more blanket fire and we're fucked. Um, uppercut. Flashbang on the back. Get the stun. Good. Then Iron Swan, the other one. Oh, it wasn't the kill that I was hoping for. But we can get a Dazzling Light. No, we can get a Judgment on the back guy and kill him. Jester may still... Oh, I didn't heal the Jester, though. That's probably a bad thing. Uppercut Slice. I think it was important to kill the back person rather than heal the Jester. And I'll stand by that even if the Jester dies.
Okay. As long as no more blanket fire. That's a that's a heavy attack. A ten damage attack that is. He's gonna get he's got buff resistance, but maybe we can do this. Pull him forward. He resisted that. Hmm. Bad for business. I go with the dark stab and just go for the kill. And the effort bleeds. Okay. The important member of the party's dead. Now we can go with the Divine Grace. Three heal, not, you know, a gargantuan amount. Oh, slice and dice. Oh my god, slice and fucking dice. On the brink, facing the abyss. Melvin has spent his whole life on Death's Door. He knows nothing else. Fuck you. Give me, give me a chance here. Give me a chance to give you the Iron Swan. Someone move to the back position so I can Iron Swan the fuck out of you. Just keep healing the Jester. That's all we can do. That's all I've got. No! Not the jet. Oh! Really? Are you shitting me? Oh my god. Oh my god. I've made a mistake. I've made a terrible, horrible, terrible mistake. I'll tell you what, it wasn't that hard when I was doing it on stream. Vigorous? Oh. So what does that mean? Solo get solo, you bastard! What does it do? Debuffs. That's not really ideal. Oh, don't give them a turn. No! No more turns for the enemy, please! Everyone's on death's door. It's it's death's door for days. I can still pull through this. Who's more important to keep? Um Let's go with the just the party heal for one, so everyone's off a of death's door. We can start this whole and dark stab the shit out of you. Right, and then kill you. Okay, we're still alive! No one's died just yet. The stress is mounting. But we're all alive. Remind yourself that overconfidence is right, slow get the jester to fuck. Killer. Get to the back of the pack. Oh my god. We're a couple of traps shy of absolute destruction here. At least we know there's no room battle here. Now, what I could do to be sneaky... Let's be sneaky. I'm gonna be sneaky, you can't stop me. Oh no, there's a room bars a battle there again. Oh fuck this. Get in that door. Hmm. I thought I could be sneaky, but obviously the game has decided that being sneaky is not an option. Right, um Right, no starvation. So what we do is we do And, um, right, okay. And if the game hit me with a starve there, I would have fucking flipped the table. I would have went crazy. Things would have been in disarray. Go with an early buff. They stun. They've got a 50% stun resistance. I think we just go for more heals. We just keep healing every character up. I can retrieve this. We can, we can work this out. 8 damage is good. Hellion is going to kill this person with a wicked attack. Oh no. Slime. Don't slime me. Keep your goddamn slimy bastard self to yourself! Uh -huh. No battle in here, please. Nice! No one died! We should get some big level up here. Here, big levels up here. So, you know, we got, like, a lot of money. And a fair amount of... Upgrade materials. Our works here are going to be quite bad because our stress was high, but we got a lot of experience. So as you see, because everyone was really stressed, that's good. Stress eater, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. It's all kind of bad. It's all relatively bad. I see something long absent in the sunken faces of passersby. Uh -huh. Big Ray Junior, what are you doing to yourself? Hope. I guess. I guess given that we've got the, the time, really do some stress relief. Um, Big Tam gets out there with relatively low stress relief though, or, or stress, realistically. I kind of want to take away anemic, maybe. Or, you know, thin-blooded. It's hard to tell what we want to what we want to do, really. Did I get any? I need some more busts. Oh wait, I do have two slots. Uh-huh. Well, given that we've got money, let's um, begin removing some of this nonsense. 
Oh, fucking hell. What does that do? You don't melee, so that's fine. Blight resist, that's probably a bit... Death is not right. Weak grip on life, probably bad. Right. That is... Wasting sickness is probably really bad. Hmm. I could wait, though, and reduce the cost. No. No, let's do it. Let's do it. And... Who else? Who else needs a little bit of... A little bit of care? Um, mm hmm. I'll not do anyone else at the moment. Oh, in fact, what did you get? Do you have. You've got witness. That's fine. Um, is it fine? We'll not take part in prayer activity in town. Oh, balls. I shouldn't have put you in there, actually, because I was going to send you straight out to do a. to do a mission. We've got a medium. We have a short. Short apprentice. I guess we'll do that as well. Anyone that I can send out on a short apprentice mission that's going to survive. Me, I'll survive. Do I have anything bad again? I've got anemic carts. Fine, fuck it. We'll do another low light. You can be at the back of the pack doing your thing. I'm going to go in. I am... Um, I'm taking risks left, right and centre here. Did I not... Oh, my roster's full, that's why. Can't possibly bring on uh, Watson. You'll be fine in the second position. You'll do all right. Um, we're going to take torches this time, just because, you know, people are not very... They're not in a good position. But to round off the episode, I was only going to do one. But, you know, given that these are really short, we just rattle through them. Where are we going again? Aye, it's two shovels worth. Is it? I think it is. Aye. And, um... Hmm. Just to get our money up and our stuff up, get the economy rolling, get some characters leveled up. Hopefully Big Tam will be level 3 as well, that would be quite nice. And we'll remove one of those negative quirks from... Addy the second. Corruption has soaked the soil. Easy. 100% of room battles, not a problem at all. Done and dusted. Evil. Hopefully with our highlight on this occasion, I will actually use one of you on here. Item has no effect, that means it must contain good things. Given that we're playing at high light, we should be low stress when we leave this. You would hope at least. That's how it would work. Left luggage. Has a lock on it. Ooh. Fasting seal. Aha. Packs and loot and stuff. Um, This worked well the last time. Will it work again? Warrior of Light. You're getting all the good shit. <laughs> Extra damage when light's high. Just what I bloody needed. Right, shovel that tree. Whatever the f It's like a big fucking tentacle. It's not really a tree as such. What about a tentacle? It's like a... Like an obese squid. An, obli an, an obese octopus. Wow, I'm glad I took that extra shovel. Game sense, they call it game sense. They call it game sense taking that extra shovel on. You would need it eventually, possibly. Right, the rapid gnashers are probably my least favourite enemies in the game. They um, suck tremendously. So we try and kill them as soon as possible. Leaving them at one health is not ideal. Use a bandage, don't be silly. Um, judgment, be judged. Dodge the judge. I had an idea that was going to happen, but you know. Um, we'll probably go for a... Probably go for a vulnerability hex and just kill. Ah, good. One dog down! Happy Tom. Now we can get a wick attack in here, hopefully, and, you know, cause some problems. This is going to suck as well, having the Enchantress. But I think it's correct to go for the dogs first. Over the stress. Cultist Acolyte. Who's actually a lady, and all this time I've been like, Oh, the guy, the guy! Apparently it's a lady. Five damage is what it is. We'll take it. Missed with a hex. Hmm. Go with the light, give us a bit more torch. And give them the hack. Hack them down. And we'll keep pushing along, keep pushing this train, keep it rolling. I'm not as scared anymore to keep the light low, which is a good feeling. Um, It's just nice to know that, you know, you can actually play the game with... Oh, Abyssal Artillery. Going big, yes! It's it's big, that is big. A 7 and a 6 is about the best you could hope for. 
Nice. Now, do I want to go with a breakthrough here? It does come with a debuff, but am I still bleeding? I'm bleeding for days. Um. Yeah, we'll go with the guy that bleeds. Work him down. I'll probably just go with a... Regular hack. I should maybe have gone for an if it bleeds on the middle fella here. Weakening curse on you, because I hate your damage. It really sucks. The debuff will be good for us. No blight. Good. Work you down. And uh, a dazzling light, perhaps. Give us a bit more torch. It's done as well. Very good, solid play. Um, let's kill you. Ah, good. Didn't even get a chance to have a turn. Game much easier when in light. Let it let it be known when li when fully lighted. So we marked. This is actually a good pairing and good setup. I could get behind this. So, occultist marks. Bounty hunter goes in big with the one that should you know. Heirloom chest. We don't have a key, do we? No, no keys. It's trapped. We get blighted, which we'll use that straight away. Scouting. No battle room. There is a battle room down here. Sadly, but it's the last one, which means that we're finished directly after. So it's nice to have the occultist into the, the bounty hunter. We just need to get the correct skills with Mr. Bounty. Which will be the finish room skill and... No, no, sorry. The... Yes, oh, we've got collect bounty anyway, that's fine. So we can work in the current setup that we have. Might as well grab the torch. So as you'll see, our stress is actually going lower and... So Big Tam's stress is lower than it was when we started. Is made clear. Obviously the low level healer isn't in such a good position, but it's fine, it's alright. We'll go with the artillery again, missed this time. Bit of a shitter, but you know, you do what you can. Dodged. I think I want to go for the dazzling light on you. Resisted the stun. Just work him down. He's a scary guy, he inflicts a lot of damage with his grope. Aye, uh, groping swipe. Ah, uh, four damage ain't that bad, is it? Maybe if we're marked, he, he does more damage. Maybe that's how it works. Rain of Blight. If it bleeds, we go for the kill. I love if it bleeds. I think that might be my favourite skill. My favourite skill in this entire game might be if it bleeds. It's just very enjoyable. Packs a punch. When you get the bleed in, it's very good. It's just very, very good. Rend your cell, you bastard. There we go. Resist. What I like to see. Boom. Five damage. Um, I'm going to go for the hack. And the kill. We're finished here, basically. You, you know, we could all go for a break at this point. We're, we're absolutely fine. Marked and debuffed. I'm going to aim for the back one. Is lit. The path is clear. If we do, require only the strength to follow it. Um. Yeah, we'll do this as well. Missed. Bad from you. Bad from you. Well, hopefully, if our bounty hunter gets a turn here, we can do something. Um. We can do something cool. So with the marked prey, we get 18 damage. Very nice. Solid play. We get some stuff and we are finished. Let's open this up. And ancient coffin. Some holy water on it. Nothing happened. I assume that means that it's good. Hidden treasure. We get some stuff. And we'll finish this one off. Could have explored a little with the torches that we have. But really I'm just leveling up characters at this point. Um, acquiring money also. So Big Tam's up to level 3. Which means we can take Big Tam out on a, a good outing. Warren's scrounger. Very good, interesting. So what are we... How are we doing then? Truth, Removed wasting sickness, that's good. We're up to 14k money. We'll continue doing the low light stuff. Let me put you up with the level 3s. We're starting to get a good batch of level 3s here. I'd like to get one um, occultist probably up at level 3. Um, we're even going to have a level 3 jester soon. How the fuck did that happen? Who let that happen? Anyway, darkest dungeon.